Hari Hari Krishna. Yeah, Krishna Hari. Basically, I want to talk with you about how 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 Krishna talks about modern modern stuff in the modern age, like science and nature, and how and how Christians and born again Christians talk about past, present, and future wherever whatever times we're, we're in basically I'm mentioning about I'm talking about Christianity because in the in the previous videos I've done you guys talk about how Christians go to church sorry how how if if we're not if we don't have if we're not happy with devotions we can always go Hindus can also always go to Christian churches so I'm trying to find that page where it talks about about Hindus Hindus can go to Christian churches I'm sure I've got it highlighted somewhere so so yeah this is what it's this is what it says on on page on page sorry on page from page 19 to 20 where it talks about how how you can how you can you can attend church christian churches so so it says on bottom of page 19 on this book the king of knowledge where it says of course if you if one thinks that the Bhagavad Gita and the Hare Krishna mantra as are part of the Hindu system and doesn't want want to accept them because of this he can nonetheless attend the attend the Christian church and sing well yeah it says attend the Christian church and sing there so yeah I'm not making these things up just to, just to pull you away from Krishna I'm actually saying it to you as, a ev as evidence so basically but, but coming back to what I said in the title about what I said about you know Christian talk about past present and future and 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 Hindu Hinduism Krishna only talks about the modern day modern day modern age in this modern age like science nature because the thing about Christianity it talks about when it talks about past present and future you know however, however far you go back from the creation of men in the Bible it, talk, it talks about it talks about present stuff which is valid for today right now as you're watching this video whatever time it whatever date you're watching it it, it still matters however old Christianity becomes however old the Bible, uh, Bible becomes it still matters in today into the day into today's society you know my, my question I, w I wanted that would I would ask to anyone that's watching this video is that if if say if say the government or or science science or scientists or people that call call nature nature or mother nature people that call that that name what happens if they they sort of merge it together and call it a completely different name and what what would we do what would what would you guys and ladies do then guys and gals do then I mean it would it would make it would make the the religion Hinduism obsolete if if the name was to change the name for science because it talks about science in this book in the in in on page from page from from the ho from the whole of somewhere in the whole of page twenty eight and also the the top the top 
two paragraphs on page 29 on the on chapter 3 it talks about that about science nature you know the reason why I don't read these things out anymore is because I want to be I need to be be careful of copyright so yeah so let's not so let's not mislead and, 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 and misunderstand what's been said in, in, in what I've said in what I've said about the, these about this in this video you know when I say misled I mean don't try not to think that you know this religion Hinduism is, is, the, is the right one for me just try and do your own examinations try not to go by what what family try not to go by what family and family and friends are saying yep it's best to just analyze the religion for yourself Hinduism and and do your own research to find out which one's the true true God like I said in the past there can only be one God and it can, there can only be one God that's correct they, all these religions they can't all all be correct you know the thing about the devil is he uses he uses many religions to confuse people and to stop them from believing in believing in God and following God so you know analyze it carefully and basically do your own personal research without any without being biased and yeah and, um, and I'm sure you will find some some answers and always be open don't close your heart and mind against religions and toward religions and faith so keep your options open if you've got any problems then please give me a, give me a call and state in the between time to call you back so yeah, <coughs> so yeah if you've got any short questions you can send it to me whenever you're ready so yeah that's that's really all I have to say in this video so bye for now and Hari Hari Krishna